development of the engine and development of the car started uh, in two parallel programs and effectively came together uh, probably in September of this year. The most significant challenge for us was um, trying to get the look and style of the Fiesta road car, a tremendously successful car, to try and bring that across into a car that was being regulated uh, by the FIA in terms of competition regulations and to get the look and style of something that uh, is appealing into a, a competition car and that is something that we're tremendously proud of uh, because that's what we've achieved. It's hugely satisfying to see the uh, Fiesta RS WRC um, developing and to see where we've got to right now with the car. Uh, it was a huge task for me and to be asked to bring this project home, uh, particularly when you consider how successful the road car has been. But uh, bringing the two teams together and delivering what we have right now has been immensely satisfying for me. Uh, it will look uh, and sound as spectacular as the Focus did. There's no question it's a, it's a great fit in this car because it's, um, it's a little bit smaller, uh, a little bit more nimble, it's sort of re the rea you know, reaction time is better. And uh, again, it's the same feeling, you know, the, the feedback, should we say, from all the drivers that have driven the car is that you know, it's just a fantastic chassis and uh, everybody seems so confident that it's just going to be a, a world-beating car. Historically, we've got a very good track record of coming out with a car and winning uh, very early on in its career. Uh, like the current Focus, as an example, won Monte Carlo first time out and then followed that up with Sweden. So, uh, you know, we, we really need to get back uh, and make sure and we can, you know, that this Ford Fiesta wins uh, as soon as possible. We will be a little bit down on, uh, on power than where we are with the, with the two litre, with the Focus. But then, you know, we've got a much smaller car, which uh, is obviously there's less drag. And so um, ultimately, we haven't done that back-to-back -back test, and for sure we will be doing it. But um, personally, I would be very surprised if, um, if, we're, uh, if we're any distance away from the focus.